Hi guys, so today we're going to do this game. It's quite new and it's called Rumbleverse. It was made this year, 2022, and it is really fun. So today I'm just gonna be teaching you all the controls in case you're just a new player and want to know how to play. So if you're the launch master, press X to launch if you're on PlayStation. Now all these controls will be on PlayStation. So if you're on a different device, you might struggle a little bit, but if you're on PlayStation, it should be easier. Now, he just went on a free for all. So, that might, like, you know, interfere with the game type. Not interfere, but you get what I mean, because he's landed somewhere else, and we might get into fights, and then we might both, they'll get KO'd. Now, the aim of this game is to KO everyone before they KO you. So, the basic attack is square. You can get power-ups by reading magazines, AKA books, like this. That's the punchline power-up. Now, square, the basic, basic attack is this. Now, if you want to do a kick attack, you press square, then triangle. <coughs> now, to dash, it's L2. To dodge, L2 and R2. To block, it's R2. So, they're basically the basic controls. But I think I need to run right now. So, yeah. Because these guys are just both on me right now. Luckily, those two decided they want to go in a fight. So, I can have a bit of a chance to run, but not a full chance. One's still chasing after me, while the other one is chasing after them, I think. Oh, well, there was a second ago. Now, I need to run. <clears throat> because if I get knocked down, I only have uh, maybe 10 seconds to live before so my teammate can revive me. And that will be really difficult to survive. So, think, fingers crossed, we win this game. But anyways, the vicious attack is triangle. So you grab someone and you flip them over your back. Yep, like that. Or should I get involved? You know what, I'm gonna wait for heals and then I'm gonna fight and then I'm gonna show you the um, attacks. So, punchline goes like this. Super kit does this. Now, I would really recommend getting a purple one. Every purple one is good, except from the worst one of all time, Skyrocket. So just avoid Skyrocket, uh, Rocket Jump, and don't think there's any green ones, but if there is, don't avoid anything with a picture of a rocket on it. They are the worst, because they just send you up in the air. So, like, we just, Basically, it's just a double jump boost. So yeah, you can hold two, um, well, you can hold two power-ups at a time. That will help you, like, def or with the game. So you can eat chi this big chicken or small chicken, and you can pick up some certain items. But, like, this, this is a metal bat. That's one item you can pick up. Now, you can't pick up every item in the game. Like, I can't pick up this lamppost. But, for example, I can pick up this metal bat. <coughs> so, that is something that we should be aware of. That you can't pick up everything. Yeah, that's how I was put it. That's how I should put it. Anyways, the Ruby Crusher is quite good, but I prefer to use these weapons. And also, I'm gonna like attack this guy. Just so, you know, kinda wanna. And anyways, I'm drinking my drink. My teammate should be coming now, and his teammate should be coming now. Or hers, I don't know. I'm just gonna call him he's because what's the boys? Anyways. Yep, that's definitely their teammate. I need to run. I need to run! <coughs> H 
anyways, so they're the basic controls. Now, if you're in duos like I am, there's gonna be four people okay, in the game. Same in, in um, solos. Now, there's only solos in duos, so if you play with two people, or four people, that's what I meant, or three, or however many, then I recommend taking it in terms, turns. That's what I usually do with my friends. Cause we all just want to do duos and stuff. But like I said, we can't. So we do sort of 1v1 and stuff like that to make it like fair. Now this is super solo. That's the best attack of all time. That's the vicious attack, what he just did to me then. So I'm just gonna run. Cause I'm a man. Anyways over here is a bronze crate. These are really good, if I'm being honest. They don't even give you a power up most of the time. They just give you some drinks, a star, and that's basically it, so. Oh, and also to give you an item to pick up. Not that good, is it? See? What a weirdo. Anyways, thing. By the way, you're gonna hear me say thing once, cause it's hard remembering what I said and what I haven't. There's so many things in this game. <coughs> but yeah, then there's a silver crate. Oh, post boxes do good damage. Anyways, there's a silver crate. They are sort of in the middle. They're blue, like I said. So green, a bronze crate is sort of green. Uh, a blue crate is silver. And the gold crate is purple, basically. So that's what they are, so you should see what you get out of them. Now, this game isn't that popular anymore, so. But it, so like, I just wanted to sort of play it, you know, see if people would like actually like the game because it is super duper fun, trust me. You'll love it once you play it. So I really recommend doing this game for people who love the games from Epic Games, but they don't like the guns games. So I'd recommend just downloading this. It is really, really good. Say that it is free. It does not cost you anything to get this game. Nothing at all, not even a one P. Yep, one P, no, it is for free. So, I would really recommend this game because it is so fun once you actually get into it. Now, I would really recommend for new players going in the playground mode because that is the good mode. That is the warm up mode. So you warm up, that's what I do every single day before I go into matches. I always, and now the superstar attack, I'm probably gonna die from this now by, right, yep. Now that yo-yo flex should revive me. Yep, revive me. So to revive your whole down circle, that's on PlayStation, like I said at the start, everything's gonna be on PlayStation in this video because I play on PlayStation. Now, I used to play on Switch, so if you wanna um, see one of my first videos, I recommend going on Switch and to yeah, going on to those videos because that's the switch. <coughs> now, I would really recommend if you have superstar mode but you don't want to use, or yeah, just if you have it in general, I would really recommend saving it because if you're about to die and you're on 100 HP and your teammate's dead, just pop it. Like, you just, it revives you basically. It's like a free revive mechanic. Like that. But also, it does really good damage. <coughs> On your teammates, so. Now, it also heals you when you're up, so. It is quite good if you're in a fight and you're quite low in health, so. A Mega Cyclone is a good one. Like, this is what a Mega Cyclone does. Just spins them around, so. Boom. 
Now, if they're on Superstar, you need to avoid them. It could do up to a thousand damage. I don't know if he already said that, but anyways, if it did, you already know. So I need to revive them before. Oh, I just stop. That is a really bad thing to do. So, oh, oh, you guys really enjoyed that like starter video. If you want to see more of my channel and from other make sure to smash that like button. And if you um, like the Rumbleverse videos, make sure to subscribe. And if you want to be one of the first people to know when my videos are uploaded here on this channel, make sure to smash that, that notification bell. I'll tell you to the link, the link side. I'll see you later on my channel. Peace.